E aí, gurizada, estamos aqui de volta no Red Dead Redemption 2. Última parte do jogo, agora é pra valer. Final definitivo. Uh, ainda, ainda tem umas duas ou três missões pela frente, então vai ser o que? Uns dois vídeos, provavelmente. Mas, essa é a parte final. Definitiva, a gente já limpou a maioria das missões secundárias no mapa. Entendeu? Não tem nenhuma disponível. Só tem uma missão principal disponível no mapa. É relacionado aí à, à vida de, de fazendeiro aí, nova, né? Vida de rancheiro do John. Agora, tipo, algum, algumas coisas faltam uh, ficar resolvidas, assim, em relação ao, ao jogo. O Micah, o Dutch, uh, a situação do, do John Marston com os Pinkerton, né? Com o governo, a família dele. Então, talvez vá acontecer bastante coisa aí a partir de agora. Nesses episódios finais Vamos chegar aqui Ainda não foi construída a torre é, Tinha uma Tinha uma torrezinha aqui assim No rancho do John No Red Dead 1 Então bora começar a missão com a Abigail So you happy? I think so And I did good? You did good. So... <laughs> am I forgiven? <laughs> Never. Ah, you are a hard woman. <laughs> Ma! Pa! Come out here! Sadie! <laughs> You're alive! John, it's... Sadie Adler. <laughs> well, how'd you know she was... We... I'm... Sorry, I you thought I... You look well. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy. <laughs> oh, well, come on. <laughs> oh, but tell me about you, darling. No armed to the teeth like that. I'm a working woman, Abigail. I'm a bounty hunter, bodyguard. I protect the gold prospectors up in the hills. I'm thinking of starting my own transportation business. I was thinking maybe if John wanted to earn some money. My husband, he ain't looking for that kind of work. Took on a lot of debt when we bought this place. And you're working for her to pay it off? Yes, sometimes I was. But I thought we said no more of that. No, you said that. What else am I going to do? I'm a goddamn man. It's legal work, Abigail. And I never got killed. It's hunting down fools for the government. Easy. Even Jack could do it. Don't you put those stupid ideas in the boy's head. He's going to do something better than this. Like what? Writing silly stories? I'm sorry, Abigail. Really, I am. I just thought if you wanted to earn some money... How many times do I gotta bury you, John Marston? Never. You ain't never burying me. It's legal work that I can handle. There's a... There's something else. Micah? Bounty hunting is one thing, but goddamn Micah? I heard he was up country, or some fellow who sounded just like him. Killed a family, bar a little girl who escaped. Leave Micah alone. Listen, I'm sorry, Abigail. I came by because I was riding by chasing a fella, and I thought John wanted to earn some extra money. What is it? Abigail, we need the money. Some fella robbed his business, you know, an accountant or something. Came down from Rhodes, I believe. How much does it pay? It pays good. Well, the soft ones usually do. Okay, then. I guess. But Micah? No. All right. John Marston, let's go. Just you bring him back to me. You hear? Of course. É, ela, ela conhece bem o Micah, né? Tipo, sabe que o cara é muito perigoso. A primeira, mi a primeira missão com o Micah demonstra como ele é um cara perigoso, tá ligado? É um psicopata. Ele, ele mira muito bem, entendeu? Toda, toda missão que tu faz com outras pessoas, os caras não sabem mirar direito. O Micah sabe. Abigail's back with the boy. He must be so pleased, John. And the ranch? You were right. It's really something. I think I'm gonna 
Ask her to, uh, marry me. I got a ring. It was... It was Arthur's. I found it in a bundle of things that I've kept. You're marrying Abigail. Or, it, asking her, at least. Oh, my. I never took you for a romantic. No, me neither. But <laughs> it's something I've thought about. And I, I think, I know, I want it. OK. I guess I thought you were married already, long ago. No, n not really. Not officially. Well, I'm real happy for you, Joan. Being married, it made me real happy. We're cutting off the main track up here. My man's in need of post. Moron accountant, Marshall Thurwell, been trying to live like an outdoorsman. Camping out here. He's lucky the Skinner brothers ain't found him. Well, they might have. A gente já matou pelo menos metade dos irmãos okay. Skinner. Must be it. Get down. Let's take a look around. Something's been here. This... This looks... Looks like a bear or something came through here. Hmm. <laughs> fella left in quite a hurry. Here. Oh, he was from the south. Whoever he is. Then maybe he's our man. If you ain't become some bear's lunch. Yeah, it looks like they went this way. Him or the bear? <laughs> Both of them. Well, well, tansioso. That's that way, I'd say. Great. Can you see which way he might have gone? Okay, I think I got him. Follow me. It keeps going through here. There's a cabin up here. Yeah, this way. Nossa. Nossa, mãe do céu. My god. Crap. Ugh, what ain't pretty. Oh boy. That our fella? Maybe. But looks more like a local farmer to me. Or what's the lift of one? Is he gone? You, Marshal Thurwell? That I am, ma'am. I'm here to arrest you on behalf of the state of Lemoyne. You're wanted for theft, fraud, and avoiding arrest. Is the monster still out there? No, I think he's gone. Come out. Come on. Don't shoot. Keep walking. <laughs> Come on. I'm coming. Look out! <laughs> Nossa. Nossa, mãe do céu. Hã? Ah? Tá vivo ainda? É script, é script. I think he's gone. Oh, fucking mo. 
monster. Thurwell! Get out here! Before I come in there and kill you myself! I I'm coming. Pathetic. Waiting to see if that animal ate us? No, ma'am. That weren't it. Yes, it were. Come here! Come here. <laughs> Thurwell, call yourself a man? Well, it's like Abigail says. That's one word for you. I can't believe we didn't kill that bastard. Why'd you crazy? Gave him something to remember us by, at least. You all right, John? Yeah. Ah. Just, we always find a way to almost get killed, don't we? Mm-hmm. That's kind of the problem. Maybe it wasn't right of me to bring you along on those really heavy things. A family man and all. Seeing all this, I don't know if I can do it again. I'm my own man, ain't I? I get to make those calls. I needed the money. You are your own man, sure. But I'm my own woman. And I get to say who I ride with. And I don't know if your ranch and your kid and your wife are things I want to be worrying about when I hear a gunshot. Yeah, fair enough. Those are fine new clothes, by the way. <laughs> yeah, I spend my cash on... Who's this up here? Is that... Are you Sadie Adler, ma'am? The bounty hunter? Get off the road! Look, I got great respect for you professionally, but if that's Marshall Thorwell there, uh, me and my partner would like to split the reward. You're doing what? Get off the road! We was thinking you might need protection. I look like I need protection. Uh, me and my partner, we're dead set on splitting that reward. And if not, well, we said we was going to have to take all of it. <laughs> <laughs> you and your partner are just children. Don't get yourselves hurt now, son. I told you she wouldn't listen. Drop him. Damn. Oh. 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 Nossa, um já foi. Nossa, mãe do céu. Ela acertou o primeiro. Tá meu chapéuzinho aqui, né, mano? Acho que só quando eu tiver parado, né? Não. Beleza. Não. I just see orders on the wall, and I try and fill them. And if there's other bastards after the same orders as I am, I get competitive. It's called industry. And if you ain't noticed, everyone is out there doing it. I guess they are. Uh, you said earlier you knew something about Micah. You gonna tell me what you know? Are you sure you want to hear about it? Ain't all that back at your ranch enough? If I find him, I will handle it. Your bounties or transport work, that's your decision to bring me along or not. But, but Micah, that's something we, well, I, I gotta do. With or without you, Sadie. You know what I mean? Okay, okay. I know. Well, I'm hearing things. A lot of things. Still, mostly just whispers, but I think you might be pretty close. When you hear something real, you bring it to me. Okay, I'll bring it to you. But you think about if this is what you really want. Everything you can get, and everything you could lose. I understand all of that. Of course I do. Here, put him down. Go on. Get home to your wife. I'll let you know if I hear anything about Micah. You need a hand taking him in? Him? No, I'm fine. You sure? 
Yeah, I'll send your share to the bank when I get paid. Thank you. Tá, então feita mais uma missão de caça recompensa com a Seiri. Um grande filho no Makenga. Deixa eu ver as os bagulho. Atire no urso quatro vezes, mate com tiros na cabeça ambos os caçadores de recompensa. Caralho, tem que ser mais rápido do que a Seiri, mano. Tipo, eu podia ter sacado minha arma antes e atirado antes, né? Mas... E outra hora de tempo. Tá. Agora surgiu mais uma missão com a Abigail. Uma coisa interessante sobre essa, essa parada aí do Maika é que... Tipo, a, a trama... A trama do Red Dead 1 é o John Marston trabalhando pro governo e indo atrás dos membros de gangue... O ex-membro... Os ex-colegas de gangue dele, Entendeu? Então a gente vai atrás de alguns deles, incluindo o Bill Williamson e o Dutch. Uh, o Maika... O Maika seria um deles, né? Então mais cedo ou mais tarde o John teria que ir atrás do Maika. Então por que não ir agora, na é verdade? Claro que ele não sabe o que, que ele vai passar no Red Dead 1, obviamente. Mas pra gente que sabe, na prática, vocês estão ligados. Vocês querem que eu bote a roupa clássica então, mano? Pra começar as próximas missões? Qual roupa clássica? Tem duas, né? Boa. Tem essa aqui. Tem essa aqui. Não, não, não é essa. É, eu, eu não tô com todas. É, 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 tá, tem essa aqui, o, o cowboy, que é a mais clássica dele. Tá? E tem aquela outra lá que é a roupa que ele termina primeiro jogo. Tá. Eu vou com essa roupa aqui então. A gente vai também com o revólverzão do John. Revólver de vaqueiro do John, beleza. Revólver de vaqueiro do John, pistola do Midnight. Então bem servido. Então bem servido. Inclusive ele tá bem parecido, ó, olha só. Cabelo parecido. Barba parecida, roupa igual. Estamos prontos. E não surgiu poncho, né, cara? O tão sonhado poncho que eu queria vestir não surgiu no Red Dead 2, infelizmente. Eles podiam ter botado, mano. Eu acho que só tem, só tem uma roupa de poncho no, no Red Dead 1. Nós podiam ter botado Tanto no 1 quanto no 2 Eles podiam ter botado mais opções ah, Vamos lá então Mais uma missão aqui com a Abigail Ih, já tá dando treta aí, mano Here, boy. Podemos começar agora, se os dois terminarem de brigar. I tell you what, woman, was a damn sight more peaceful round here before you came back. You're just lucky I'm a soft touch. I should sling you out by your ear. Ah, oh, you always was a cold-hearted lizard of a woman. And you always was someone willing to live off the efforts of others. It's walk or work, old man. I got lumbago. You'll have more than that in a oh, minute. Oh, John, tell her about my health. Do what the lady says. I work my fingers to the bone. Building this place, Abigail Roberts. Marston! Abigail Marston, Miss Marston to you. Miss Marston to you. Why you let him stay? He's actually been pretty useful in a useless sort of way. Who's that? No idea. Friend or foe? We'll soon find out. It's the Gettys boys. From Proghorn Ranch? Yeah. Mr. Milton! Mr. Milton! Duncan! Sir, Ma found some old furniture in the attic. Pa thought maybe you folks would want it as a housewarming present, you know? Uh, they send their regards. How kind they are. Tell your mom, Paul, we're very touched. Where would you like the furniture? Uh, just over here. <laughs> Then we can arrange. This is real kind of y'all. You saved the ranch. Pa said this is the least he could do. Well, that's about everything. <laughs> 
Send your paw my best regards. Tell him he's got friends for life in me and my family. Bye, sir. Ma'am. I can't believe this. It's so kind. Sure. But there's still some more things that we need to get. How about we take a ride into town? It's been ages since we spent any time together. It has. Let's go get the wagon. Okay, let's go. I feel like we ain't done nothing together like this since... since, uh... Since forever? Maybe not forever, but a long time. We ain't had the time, you know? We've both been working hard. And now we got something to show for it. The ranch, this life. It's so nice, John. I hope it'll only get nicer. O Jack tá sempre do lado de alguma das árvores, né, mano? Olha lá, ó. Vai entrar ou não vai entrar, mulher? May I help you, my lady? <laughs> oh, John. And now to Blackwater. Uma velocidade normal aqui para não não ir tão rápido. Is there anything you want to do? You said there were some things we still needed. We can buy them from that catalog. Let's go have some fun. I know your idea of fun, John Marston. <laughs> I ain't had a drink and well. <laughs> Acabou de beber. Não, eu mean, good, wholesome fun. Like, uh, decent folk have. We decent now? I guess. <laughs> well, decent or not, I still got some errands to run. That's fun. What would you like to do? Maybe get our portrait took, for starters. Portrait? There's a fella in town takes photographs. You want to stare at a portrait of yourself all day long? I hate to break it to you, but you ain't that much to look at. No, I want a picture of us, me and you, okay? Okay then, sure. Is there anything else you want? I don't know. Let's just walk around and see where it takes us. I do have to be back by dinner time. Uncle Jack and Charles will manage fine without you. Hell, looking after themselves may even be good for them. <laughs> They'll starve. And that may be good for him too. With any luck, Jack and Charles will eat uncle. <laughs> Don't get my hopes up. <laughs> so maybe you're right. We'll stay. You know I am. Okay then. Portrait it is. Programinha de casal aqui então, mano. Vamos tirar umas fotinhas. E no teatro. Não sei, no teatro não sei ainda se bom. Essa casa ali tá sendo construída, hein? Talvez se a gente der um tempo ela, ela fica pronta. Let me help you down. Why are you being so courteous? I don't know. There you go. I'm gonna head to the drapers for a minute. Won't take long, but I need to get some materials. You want to come with me or wait here? And after that, we can go get our photo taken? Yeah, after that, we can get our photo taken. All right. Let's get that picture taken. It means that much to you. It does. Today it does. You're acting kind of funny. I am kind of funny. <laughs> A different kind of funny. Am I annoying you? No. I like this version of you. It just, it just ain't you. Well, maybe I've changed. Finally? I don't know. Probably not. Well, hello, madam. Sir. 
Hello, sir. How can I help you? We're... We'd like to get our photo taken. Oh, a photo. Yes, yes, that I can help you with. Yes. So, uh, what do we do? I'm sorry, what did, what did you want? Uh, our portrait taken. Oh, well, we do that. Yes, wonderful. Handsome couple, quite something, but you need a background. A background? Yes, we have Niagara Falls. Paris by night. <laughs> we have Mount Vesuvius and its ruins. We have the open prairie. T take, a, take a look. Pick one. What do you think? Let's see the others. Tacataratas do Niagara. It's dramatic, ain't it? <laughs> Let's see what else they got. Ruinas do, ruinas do Vesúvio. This is pretty. Or spooky, maybe. Let's see everything. Isso aqui parece o quê, mano? <risos> A gente não passou por Paris de noite ainda. That's nice. It's like being back home. Was that all of them? É, parece, parece o rancho mesmo. Ou aquilo ali era Paris de noite. This is, uh, mm. <laughs> This <laughs> Dentro de um salão. Surely there's a photograph of you in a bar already. Look. This was your idea, John. It's up to you. Tá, então aquilo ali era Paris de noite mesmo, cara. O que mais combina é esse aqui, né, mano? You've seen all of them. Anything you like? Ah, vamos botar isso aqui, mano. É bonito, né, cara? Bora então. Ah, this one. Wonderful. That will be simply perfect. You know, I wish I had the Congo River, but they require grass skirts. I couldn't afford them. It's just so exotic. You stay there. I'll make a pose that you feel comfortable with. Well, this is dignified. <sighs> Try to enjoy. I think I'd rather be cleaning the outhouse. Escolher pose. Be quiet. Thought you were a cowboy, not a poser. Oh no, I'm a poser. I learned from the best. That is true. So he aí, mano. So he can Chandler. Feel free to use the chairs if you want. Excellent. Nossa, que romântico, cara. Usando as cadeiras. Ah, é, é foto de velho. Aí é foto de velho, ó. You've done this before. Foto de velho. Essa aí é sem graça. Ó, tá parecendo. Oh, I like it. Parece um chefe de família desse jeito. Very good. Essa aí tá mais style. Vamos ver o que mais temos aqui. Os dois na cadeira. So natural. Particularly you, sir. Aí, aí parece que eles estão tendo uma DR, uma terapia de casal. Aí então nem se fala. Lovely. Tá, aí volta pro início. Tá, então são essas as poses. Vamos ver de novo. I think you've covered all the permutations. É verdade, é verdade, é verdade. Volta aí, volta aí, volta. Não dá pra tirar o chapéu, né, mano? Quer dizer, teria que sair antes pra depois tirar o chapéu. Agora já era, né? Tá, essa aqui tá boa. Vambora. Bravo! Now, give me a minute. I'm going to develop this for you. Wait here. Take your time. <laughs> What? Nothing. Nothing at all. Tough guy. Gunslinger. Excuse me? <laughs> Nothing. I didn't say anything. I just posed. Shut up. <laughs> you know, you're not very nice to me. Oh, I'm nicer than you deserve. <laughs> True. <laughs> Here. Came out beautifully. <gasps> sure. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, look at that face on you. Be quiet. <laughs> What do I owe you? Five dollars. 
Five dollars. There you go. Thank you. I'll see you again. Oh, yes. He'll probably come in for a pose. He seemed to enjoy himself. <laughs> Bye now. Ah, não deixou nem a gente ver a foto, mano. Não deixou a gente ver a foto. Ah, agora dá pra ver, peraí. There is one thing I hadn't done. I never been to see one of them moving picture shows. Never? No. Cara, na verdade. Bom, Let's go do that. Deixa rolar a missão, vai. Eu sabia que eles iam no teatro, mano. It's the marvel of the age. I love marvels. <laughs> ok, good. Well, let's go. Ah, mas teatro sem o Arthur não é a mesma coisa, cara. Come in. <laughs> Thank you. What's playing? Something called sketching for sweetheart, I think. Oh, hello. Two tickets, please, to see sketching for sweetheart. That'll be 50 cents, please. Okay. É muito barato. I have no idea. <risos> é muito barato entre aspas, né? O dinheiro valia mais Thank naquela época. Again. Come on in. A mystery awaits. É, não é teatro, né? É cinema, theater. Né? É outra coisa. Isso é a primeira vez que a gente faz. Eu não fiz em off. Just incredible. It's like they're really there. Hey, I'm trying to watch this. Vou louco. Abraçar a Abigail. What are you doing with that arm? I thought you might be cold. Meu Deus, mulher. That's women for you. Don't you dare, John Marston. What? I'm watching. Please. Shh. Looks so real. It's not. Don't be such a sour puss. Shh. <laughs> Stop it. She's a piece of work. Really? Shh. Yeah, Sadie. Is it over? I think so. Come on. Okay, foi mais curto que o teatro. Be seeing you. All right. <laughs> we better get home. <laughs> oh, we never get out. The farm will be fine. <sighs> the farm. I love hearing that. Let's go down to the lake for a minute. The lake? Sure. <laughs> Why, you finally gonna drown yourself? In a manner of speaking, I guess I am. <laughs> Happily so. You're acting real strange. E pior que ele se afoga oh, mesmo se ele pular. Come on. You're a silly man, John Marston. What, a, what about Jim Milton? Oh, he's even worse. Let me help you in. <laughs> like I said. Mighty strange. I like to row. <laughs> Since when? You can hardly swim. <laughs> I don't plan on capsizing. Ela só chineleia a ele, mano. I wonder whose boat this is. <laughs> don't matter. We'll have it back. I hope they don't think we're... They won't think anything. Don't think. We're borrowing. I hope we don't got leaks or nothing. She's seaworthy, okay? <laughs> Relax. Look around. All I can see is a strange man rowing. <sighs> Here's good. Ain't it pretty? What are you asking? Will you? <laughs> Will you marry me? Get up. I am married to you. No, I mean proper. In front of God. You serious? I 
got this ring. I've had it for a long time. Take it. You serious? It would make me very happy if you would... We've lived a lot of lives. Let's just live this one from now on. You and me, Jack, a family, by law. John, I, I never, I didn't know what mattered to you. It didn't, but now it does. If you think this is dumb, I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> Shut up, you silly man, and kiss me. <laughs> Pelo menos ele não pediu ela em casamento num jogo de, de basquete, né, cara? Uma partida de basquete no telão, sabe? Nossa, que romântico! Um moleque trocou de roupa. Legal, mano. Caralho, que bela... Bela missão, né, mano? Porra. Daria pra ficar aqui um tempinho, hein? É, mano. O tu também ama, exatamente. Tá. Então agora nós temos uma missão... Novamente com a Abigail Não vou nem ver o que quer, é, né, mano? Pra não estragar a surpresa Mas aqui tá o John no... Perto do bom lugar Olha, tem uma... Parte da cerca destruída aqui, cara E essa... E essa vida aí quase acabando, mano? <risos> que, que... Como assim essa... Essa vida aí quase no fim, mano. Não era pra ser o fôlego quase no fim? Vou comer um bifão aqui então, mano. Tá. A cerca foi destruída aqui mesmo, hein, cara. Bom. É, na verdade, o um bom lugar é aqui assim, né? Um bom lugar... Se constrói com humildade, é bom lembrar Aqui é mano sabotagem Vou seguir sempre Vou seguir sempre de lantragem Vou honrar, provar No Brooklyn, tô sempre ali Pois vou seguir, com Deus, enfim Uma passagem no galinheiro aqui, ó Vamos diretaço já, vamos começar a próxima missão Opa, fez esquema, tá lá embaixo, é verdade Logo, logo a gente vai botar pra cima de novo A missão da Abigail vai ser ah, Dentro de casa novamente <risos> 